doing some research on Google and there is sunburn lips and then there is sun induced cold sores and I think that's what I have because I have like five blisters on my bottom lip and I know people make fun of me and say things about me having cold sores. I've had cold sores all of my life since I was like five years old. Some people get cold sores and some people don't and it sucks. It's makes me feel very self-conscious because people are always like saying stuff about cold sores which is annoying but you know cold sores are very common i've used that stuff called abriva it has never worked for my cold sores and usually cold sores last about a week on me i have this stuff called campo Fanique, and it has like this numbing stuff in it that helps pain and itch but it's just something that i've had all my life like I don't always have cold sores. Sometimes I'll go a year without one or I'll go six months. It just like stays like dormant in your body. But most adults carry the virus for cold sores. Some people get it, some people don't. It just depends on the person, but that's the way it is. So it is the worst thing ever because they like burn, they itch. They're painful, and especially when they scab, they'll like be like bleeding. It's not a fun thing. A lot of people will say like, if you feel it coming, you know, put something on it. But most of the time, when I get cold sores, I don't feel it beforehand. Not like some people will get like a tingle or itch. I'll just wake up with them, and it sucks. And I've tried Abreva, which is supposed to be like the best cold sore medication, but it's never helped me. And it's like twenty dollars, and it's never helped me at all for my cold sores. And I have this stuff, Campo Fanique. It fights cold sores with a powerful formula to immediately relieve pain and itch, dry cold sore, and moisturize surrounding areas. But you know, it still never gets rid of it fast. Like I feel like they just take like a week to heal and it's annoying <laughs> all of the folders i have on my new ipad so this is you know social networking facebook and facebook messenger instagram youtube tiktok twitter i have my gmail google and then under entertainment i have netflix hulu disney plus prime video amazon music spotify pandora fios tv roku imovie um apple tv kindle podcast amazon alexa for my shopping i have amazon sephora ulta target etsy shein walmart zulily wish and these are my news apps i have tmz e news fox news Newsbreak, just different news apps and then these are the games i have on my ipad i have roblox i have hotel hideaway i have avakin live i have disney arena I have Disney Kingdoms, and I have Fruit Ninja. I actually do play Roblox, by the way. <laughs> but let me know if there are any apps you think I should download on my iPad. Like 50% of the population have cold sores, and I hate how people are always like, ew, you're gross, you have herpes, which yes, it is a form of herpes. Also, chicken pox, if you ever had that, is a form of herpes as well. I just feel like people are uneducated about it and tons of people in the world have cold sores a lot of times it stays dormant in your body and then it pops out and says hello at certain times and it sucks and it doesn't mean you're unclean it doesn't mean you have hygiene problems it's just something that you really can't control and some people get cold sores i hate people that make you feel like awful about it like they make you feel like you're ugly and gross and diseased it's really really awful i hate it me no filter i have cold sores on my lip people get cold sores it's not uncommon people make it out to be like it's very gross and like it's so not heard of which I've gotten so many messages of people telling me they have cold sores and they've had them since they were a kid. So it's so nice to hear that I'm not alone and I get cold sores. The heat brings it out. Sometimes, you know, cold brings it out. All different type of things. Stress, anxiety, but yes, that's me. So 
I have never seen my mom or dad with a cold sore as long as I've known them and I don't share drinks with anyone like that's not something I do I don't share drinks or utensils I've never done that so that's I'm just not sure how I got cold sores but I've had them since I was probably like five years old but it's just a cold sore it's not that big of a deal I know never to kiss someone or share utensils or drink from someone when I have active cold sores so yes but it's just cold sores let's move on and I know some people will get a tingle or an itch before they get a cold sore or like a burning sensation but I don't get that I'll just like wake up one day and I'll have like a full-blown cold sore breakout and it sucks but I move on at the end of the day it's not life-threatening it's just a cold sore and millions of people have it. I got in so many messages today telling me your experiences with cold sores and I really, really appreciate it. I love knowing that like, I'm not the only one going through something. Like, it makes you feel better when you know other people struggle with the same thing. Gracie is a mega star. Hello. The convincing part when it's almost over. It's a website in that room. Yes. She's in the front of my iPad. <laughs> And some Animal Crossing. I love my little doggy section and then my pumpkin patch. And yeah, these flowers are growing like crazy. And there's some weeds I need to pick. But yeah, this is like my little wedding area. I love it. It's so cute. We can go up to this. I think it will play. I haven't played Animal Crossing on the TV in a while. So I thought, why not? This is one of my favorite games. So you know how it goes. Over here I have a lot of flowers, like a lot of flowers. More flowers over here, just kind of everywhere. And then, oh, I can get that fossil later, but I have this like tree or orchard, I guess, with a bunch of different trees, pears, peaches, cherries, oranges, all of them, apples. A little crazy, but I love them. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got some peaches. I get my peaches out in Georgia. Then I go over my little bridge. Oh, I got some weeds I need to clean up. It's my little entrance way. I love it so much. I love my little entrance. Obsessed. 